Lunch time. We could find some people here that are everywhere, like Shadow Robot Company, with their hands well known. Some manipulators and uh, percepting with these small, tiny cameras and applications based on the ABD. With a manipulator here. Nanyang Technological University from Singapore is using this manipulator here and also this robot here. The previous manipulator was from the Universal Robot, widely used everywhere. And uh, Phoenix Pro Flight Controller Learning Kit by RobotSense. Some drones, applications, have their own autopilot here. And also here, there is a AGB that could navigate indoors with some LiDAR located at the top. Some ultrasonic sensors here, some additional LiDAR here. We have some big underwater or overwater robots, some platforms for the sea. Most of them are research platforms. Fourth dimension have some haptic systems. So manipulating these haptic systems you get out some simulation of what is happening here. Haptic systems are used everywhere for medical purpose or for using very precise manipulation. Here is the Robocap Federation. Small drones with, from Big Craze. This really tiny drone, this one. From Big Craze. Moog have some solutions mainly for manipulation here. Some haptic sensor uh, manipul uh, devices. Arms of uni uh, from Universal Robots are everywhere. And this export, uh, export kinetic also is everywhere. Also, that one is a bit old. Some drones from UB5. A lot of people having lunch here. This is the lunch time. Red Dot Robotics with a prototype of autonomous car. The Singapore Industrial Automation Association. Some friends. GT Robot Technology. They have some small robots here. Educational robots and for leisure. Infineon Robotics with some interesting drones for warehouses and for other purposes. Amazon Robotics is also here, although they do not have anything. Surprising. KUKA. Always, everywhere, with the manipulators. Here, the friends from for robotics, we have here their Tiago robot with the manipulator, cameras. They have many different solutions. So here, at 
Nihon Winery, they have some sort of controller for a manipulator, some sort of haptic different manipulator. It's difficult to go in deep in uh, all the details in a so short video, but at least you get an idea what we could find here. Neuromeca have also these manipulators. As you could see, it's lunchtime. <laughs> also, Beijing, the Weibot technology of this mobile manipulator. People from IIT. The Ross Industrial Consortium. The Shanghai Yotong University with this steward platform. And the other one quite complex with a lot of actuators. Very impressive. Oh, I see another kinetic here. <laughs> Although it is old, everyone still uses it. In Hokuyo, with their well known LiDAR systems. Just engineering. Also, they usually have more things. They have just this clear path AGV that they are using for some projects and this other interactive platform. Tokyo Robotics is using this manipulator in labs. Friends from Fetch Robotics also with this mobile manipulator, able to navigate indoors, this in Ross. Also, they have other solutions. Here, Intel have some solutions, but not Intel only. There are many other developers here. It's using Intel Open Robotics for us. The turtle bot from very small to some bigger units Ross enable Kawasaki with some sort of manipulators collaborative manipulators Hotech is here with some educational robots and for entertainment these nice humanoids and some other smaller units Phoenix Technologies with 3D motion capture units people from Haption, this sort of haptic device, and this self-balancing robot from AB Robotics. I have seen this, this platform keeping the, the balance during 
hours so it seems quite reliable congratulations to the developers Okay, and our systems incorporated with some hydraulic linear actuators and other sort of actuators. Clear path with their research and development platforms for navigation outdoor or even indoor, having also the manipulator from Universal Robot and other platform there. JDCOM have a nice boat here with some vehicles. And drones. And a very, very big drone there. Quite, quite big. And impressive. A spraying painting robots. Big robot. Very big. Very big indeed. With a manipulator at the top. That is presumably doing all the painting or like a kind of elevator, automated elevator for painting. DJI with the Mavic and other drones they have. DJI Matri and something here, yeah, in the corner. DJI, so manipulators from Mujin. Pick up the place. This other big one, very very fast unit. This is the console. Controlling the robot. It uses a packing system for moving the boxes. Cruise automation is also here with some solution for driverless cars. And the Shanghai Fourier Intelligent Company with some exoskeletons. A robot. We all know what a robot sells. Madworks. Madworks. Well, Madworks. Madlab. Simulink. You know. And uh, yeah, it's about software simulation. An Uber. <laughs> OptiTrack. The well-known cameras for positioning indoors. Daubo Robotics, company from here, is really distributing and integrating some solutions from Robotnik, Spanish company, and also some manipulators. Kitech that distribute also some sort of drone platforms for development mainly. And the new factory that I have a um, laser arm that is creating some sort of picture using a laser beam the wallpaper. So this is ICRA 2017 Singapore with very nice views 
of the bay, Singapore. And also more people there enjoying the meal. All the conferences are down there on the other floor. And here is the exhibition area. Welcome to Singapore. <laughs>